idea play um, costs $129. That's the manufactured uh, suggested price. I opened it up and I saw this and I thought, oh, very cool. And I took it out and I realized that the tablet was already in its case. So that already is really awesome. So this Android tablet, um, it has a seven inch display and it has a front view um, camera and it has its own little case. This one is orange. Uh, I don't think that they come in other colors, but um, I mean, I just saw the box and it has an orange one and orange, so I figured they probably don't have any other kinds. So then I got the, the tablet inside and then it has um, all the little pamphlets. It tells you, the, it gives you the user guide. It tells you about Famingo, Famigo. Um, and then it also has you, it also has all the safety compliance warranty information. Um, aside from that, it has the charger which is this here and the charger just gets connected on the side like that and so you just connect that to the wall so there's no external battery it's just already inside it has earphones for the kids although if you have younger kids I would suggest that you get those earphones that have the um, volume control which um, this may have it but I don't know there's something about little tiny earphones that I kind of just like the bigger ones, the ones that go over the over the head. And then it has, let me see. Okay, it has a little USB thing. And then that plugs into here. So when you're looking to um, transfer over photos or whatever that the kids take onto your computer, you can do it like that. And then it has, um, it has this here. So the idea plate comes in this handy case and it's really cool because um, it's really protected all around the sides and um, it lets you access the camera um, and it has a speaker on the back and then like this grip makes sure that it's not dropped too often <laughs> um, and then on the side you'll see that it has um, for the for, to connect it to the computer to connect it to the outlet and then it has like this little button that turns it on on the side so you would slide it through and then this is the home screen. And so the home screen, um, it has a lot of um, it has a lot of pre-installed stuff down here at the bottom, and then it has this um, this idea play welcome that will kind of walk you I through. I want to kind of show you what the um, introductory thing would look like. You would just click start once you put in your birthday. You click start, and then it gives you a couple few tips, um, and a lot of it is like you know like the iPad, which is what we have. You just you know you swipe, you pinch, you tap, whatever, um, and then. You can connect your um, your wireless setup here and wear Star Wars and you would go through that whole thing. Um, and then after that you would um, you would choose which one you actually want to download stuff from. Either the Idea app, which is what this whole thing is, or the Amazon App Store, which you may already have because you may have like a Kindle or something else like that. So I'm going to go ahead and go on that. And it's gonna start downloading everything. So then once we actually download like the app, the marketplace, um, we click next and then it'll tell you the support that you need because you know you might need some help every now and again. Then after that, you just need to register your product. And then you can launch Famigo, which is um, you can launch it into parent mode or kids mode. And so Famigo gives you a seven day trial and you can do apps and videos and after that it's only $7.99 $7 a month after that and so um it has like major characters like you know Sid the Science Kid, Cat in the Hat, um it has DreamWorks characters it has just a bunch of different things that you really that you know your kids like so once you have the idea play and it's all set up and you want to just give it to the kids so they can hang out and stuff you as a parent We'll just go onto the Famigo app and it would pop up. And so here you would see um, all the different apps that it currently has right now. And these are all the ones that are on this um, tablet right now. And here you can choose which ones you want to block. So like let's say you're giving it to like your two-year-old kid. Well, you probably don't want him playing uh, Ninja Rush or you probably don't want him playing, you know, some of these things that might either be too over the head for them or... Um, or too violent or they just don't need for example the app store you could just block it okay well some of these will have um internet option on the app 
So what you could do is you could have, um, and these are all entered and off. So you could just click that. So because these are already enabled to so have the internet off and not an option, I, mean, I was just going to show you what would happen. So if you want it on, um, that app, which is Fun Counting, would display ads and collect data. Okay, you click OK, you know that's going to happen. You know, but you probably want to have it off. So that's what you would do here. And then up here are these all these new games that um, that they're actually coming that are out on the marketplace right now that you may not have. These are your settings here, and here you have um, all these different things that you can have. For example, this Famigo wish list, which I'll show what it is right now. But it's basically um, it it lets kids access the wish list that they that they can use when they're in play mode. So let's say they see an app and they go, "Oh, I want that." Well, they can't purchase it because it's not their t you know it's their tablet, but they can't purchase it. They have to add it to the wish list. And then the parent would go in there and they would see what the kid wants. And you go, okay, fine, I'll get that for you. Um, and then it has, you can prevent it from sleeping when they're in play mode. Um, you can block internet for all apps. So you can do all these different things. And to go back, you just press the little back arrow. And so then you also have this button in the middle. That's a contact us button. And, um, and then you have the timer. So the timer here... You can put in, you know, you wanted a timeout after one minute, and then you will start the timer. And so once you start the timer, it takes you to this screen, and this is what the kid would see. So your kid would see, um, these are the apps that they're able to play when they're in Famigo. And so that, let's say with them play math. They would open it up, and I'm just going to turn off the sound because it's really loud. Um, so they would just play, and I'm playing, and this is really gross. Okay, so what equals five? Three plus two, yay, I'm so awesome. Um, three plus two, yay. Okay, one plus one. So as you can see, it's very educational if you actually, um, let it be. And then you have all these little gross bugs. You know, kids like bugs. So one and one, and then four and three. And so you can actually have this. So like, okay, you need to do this for like 30 minutes. So you need to do this for like 15. And then, for but we put it at one, and it says time's up, ask your parents to add more play time. And so if you wanted to add more play time, you just click add more time. And then this is uh, um, the pattern that actually unlocks it for the parent to be able to use it. And if you want to make it tricky or if the kid, I mean, a kid sees this and they're going to go, what the heck am I supposed to do with all these little dots? Well, as a parent, you would go and this is the pattern to unlock it. This is a standard pattern that it comes with, but you can change it. And then you would click in there and you would add time to it. So that's what's really cool about this. Um, so I'm just going to show you what it looks like. And this oh, this red here, if you, see, if you can see closer, um, it says zero. That means there's zero numbers on the wish list. And then you can lock it by clicking that. So when you click that, it's locked, which means that the kid is only is able to play in Famigo in a locked version. And because I just clicked that and not a timer, you can just use it as a locked version without a timer. Um, and so like, let's say you want to, okay, I want to, I want that one. Okay, well, you can't buy it because you're a kid. So then the parent, so you just click to add a wish list and you would see on there that it's, it's been added. And so as a parent, you would be able to go in there and say, okay, the, my kid wants that app. I'll go and get it for him or not get it for him. Um, sometimes though, I'm seeing that, um, it's kind of hard to press down on it or it's like it, it doesn't respond very well. So I'm not sure if that's because of the coding on it or I don't know what it is. Okay. So then, okay, so then there you are. And then to unlock it, you will go down here. There's the three little baby dots right there and you would just click unlock. And well, the kid wouldn't be able to do that. As a parent, you would do that. And then, you know, you can see the wish list on there. Okay, my kid wants that. I'm going to click it. And then it gives you the option to actually get it or remove it from the wish list. So that's what's really cool about this is the fact that you can really just let it, just give it to the kids and they can kind of just play with it and um, it can do all that stuff. 
and so then you can also see how much the kids have used it the history all that stuff see and you can see how long they've been playing it so okay i played ice rage um one for one minute 21 minutes ago and okay and you know and, and that way you can really track because if the kids able to pick this up i mean you don't know how long they're going to play it and then you can manage your subscriptions which you may or may not have um and then you can actually have um apps that are open because you can use this as a regular tablet and so as a regular tablet it would have um it actually does have internet because it is a tablet um it has different apps it has you can put movies on it there's a calendar there's um doodle jump you know so it's actually um a lot of different things i mean anything that you would expect from a tablet this is but it has the added function of it um of the protection of the fact that you can just give it to your kids run the famigo and then just be able to use it without worrying about them going onto the internet and looking at things that they shouldn't see so this idea play um is available for 129 and as of today it's available online at best buy sears fries amazon so I think it would make a really cool gift for like Christmas, birthdays, um, and then also you can buy it at Fry's and the retail location. So if you actually didn't want to wait, you just want to go out there, you can do that. It is COPA compliant, which means that it abides by the U.S. government's Children Online Privacy and Protection Act. Act. So um, it's very safe and it's just great for kids. I have two kids, ages two and five, and they love it. <laughs>